Hi ladies, this is Melanie, and I am bringing you a video. This is uh, a two-part video. One is I received the My Snippet Square from the Shabby Chic Pretty and Sweet group. And the, my square was done by Belinda Films. And uh, she is all the way in Australia, down under. And, um, it took a long time to get here, but it was well worth the wait. So, uh, this is the package. I think it's awesome to have memorabilia from different countries and such. And I just like the package, even. Um, but, so, isn't that cool? Okay, so, this is what she sent. Two-part meaning. Um, she sent the snippet square right here. And, um, she was an angel and took my partner's place on the friendship swap that we were having. Um, my partner was not able to fulfill her part. And so, Belinda was sweet enough of an angel to take that and fulfill that for me. And thank you so much. I really do appreciate that. And thank you, Donna. For arranging that and I hope all well is all is well with Amy's family so um let's get to it here so the first thing we'll go with the friendship because that's the oldest oldest part of uh, the the quilt uh, square the snippet square quilty square is actually the newest part of the swap so for this um, it was really sweet the way she had the package. She had, like, she had this doily here. Um, like she had the the square on, uh, kind of folded a little bit, laying on top, and a few little tags. And I was like, oh, well, that was sweet. And she made this beautiful card. Uh, she uh, did some layering on it. She put some little... Um, brads on it she did some um a dye with some stitching on it and then wrote me a note and uh, a really sweet card and then there was this doily that she uh altered and it has a little um that lace that hair lace uh hairline lace or whatever you want to call that lace and some pretty daisy lace a little bird cage with some sparkles in it and some pearls or a window whatever and, and some pretty wallpaper paper in the background and uh just a really pretty cute little altered doily oh and some little burlap back there so a uh, real pretty layered doily i love it i love the colors very blue and very subtle and pretty so goes nicely with the card and then there are, oh, no, that didn't come with it. Uh, there are some tags here. It says here, tags. And she put it in a nice, pretty little baggie with uh, some more uh, ephemera on it. And it is stamped handmade. It also has some stitching on this die. And she inked the edges and put some pretty papers and layered it. And I, I haven't opened it yet. I think I'll keep it that way in the baggie. And then, oh, and I want to show you the envelope that she put that card in. I get getting close. Look how she made her own envelope and zigzag sticks it on the sewing machine. It's just a cute little thing. Isn't that sweet? And here's the front. It says, Make and Wish. And it coordinates with the little doily, I think. Um, here's a, a blue butterfly in the front. Just some pretty, pretty, pretty paper. And a belly band. I think this might have been in here like that. I'm not sure. Uh, <laughs> when I took it all out, I was so excited to get a package. Finally, I got a package from somebody. And um, then uh, I love the way she did her own card. Uh, envelope and card. So that's really pretty. And then not only was that in there. Uh, like I said, she fulfilled the friendship a rack that we were to do she sent some lace it looks like maybe several 
pieces? I'm not sure. Maybe I should open. I don't know. I don't know. I open it. <laughs> uh, it's a pretty paper. And let's open this up. And let's take this out. Oh, it's a tag and some lace. Okay. So here's some pretty lace that she has on here. And it looks like she may have that just a uh, tad bit glued just to keep it together or pinned. Well, I'm thinking it's glued a tiny bit. Yeah, I did that too. I tacked mine down with some hot glue um, just to um, tack it down. And isn't that pretty? Beautiful heart lace. I love that. Oh, let's go ahead and look at the pretty card underneath it with the butterfly. Isn't that pretty? She does a lot of beautiful layering and inking with these little stitch dies that she has. So, some pretty, pretty, pretty lace. And here's another tag that she did. Same kind of dye and stitching and inking. Very pretty. And then there was, and here's the little top note thing that she put on there. And then on this one, it has some pretty little trim up here that says gift tags. And I guess we'll open this one too. I don't like to open things when they're so pretty like this. <laughs> okay, let's see. And then there are some tags in here. Take that out and let's see. Here's a little booklet with some crochet trim, some little cheesecloth, a, a pretty pale yellow bowl, uh, a picture inked lightly and you can make this into a card and then this right here is another tag with uh some pretty inking and that dye pretty pretty paper pink paper so that's really nice and then she made me a file folder um what do you call these things? journals I the journal. She put, she did some lots of layering of lace on this thing. She put some pretty uh, I'll open it uh, front and back. She did some inking. She put some trim and then folded it over. She put this beautiful layered upon layered upon layer flower here with bunches and bunches and bunches of lace under there. And a big light. Here's some fishnet looking lace. And here's that lace folded over. And then I thought this pulled out. But it doesn't. It's just a beautiful picture behind there. Uh, some pearl trim and applique. Some appliques here with pearls. Here's a pretty applique down here on the corner. And look at this little um, lace. I mean trim that is loose. But uh it's not loose falling off. It's just pretty. It's like hangs pretty. And uh, this dangles too as well. So uh, under all these um, layers. So beautiful front uh, to this book. And like I said, this gives me a fantastic idea with file folder um, journals. So open it up. And she has uh, some little uh, trim ends. And some little flowers with pearls. Where you and she has this pretty card here on the inside. She's covered the spine with some trim. And this is a paper clip that comes off. And it's layered. I mean, this thing is layered. She has this layer on, a layer behind that one. She has some cheesecloth looking lace coming out. She has uh, several more tags layered under that, and one in the back, and a paper clip layered under that. Then she has these things layered. She's a layering lady. Uh, she likes to do her layers, and I love it. So uh, that paper clip goes on there. Some beautiful papers. Oh, I think I just tugged on my camera. Hold on, let me readjust. I'm not sure I moved it, but we're going to move it back because I'm looking at my, at my um, hold on, I'm looking at my camera and I'm not, I'm not sure why I'm not seeing it all that clear. Uh, I hope y'all are seeing it. That's pretty good. Okay, um, 
turn the page and it has a printed page here too then she has some more layering of lace she has some stamp images looks like um i posted more it says france and some script writing then there's this pocket here with a card in it pocket here with a card in it. and you could just do so much more to this book this is just a beginning of the book and i may have skipped a page i'm not sure no i didn't uh here's another one here's another look at that um like mixed media or inking uh stenciling of this right here on these pages beautiful beautiful i love that and then she made a pocket here on this side or belly band no pocket and it has these two tags in here this one and she has uh this one here and she has a paper clip up here for the other side and then she has this like a handkerchief type thing uh, uh making the pocket i could tell i had a handkerchief like that uh before and she's got some there you could tuck under uh under this right here uh you could you know tuck some things underneath that uh probably you could put a stopper down here and tuck some things under there as well lots of things come to mind for me to do with this book it's a fun book to get and uh this was the paper clip that was on the other side with a flower on it and an image here some more uh paper and it's really neat she rounded the corners there there's some real faint writing lines journaling lines lines that way and lines that way really really different i love it and here's some crochet trim that hangs down and another printed uh, paper. She's got stitched in here. Let's see. And here's another printed paper. Then this is some, like, I don't know how she dyed that or she printed it. But it looks more like she uh, had a screen and rubbed it. Or, you know how you do a pencil and it leaves them? I don't know how she did it. But it's pretty anyway. I'm not going to guess. So tell me. It may come from this stamp. I'm not sure. But it sure is pretty. Um, and this is Paris. It says something. I, can, I don't speak French. So I just can. I just chateau something. And Paris. It's all I recognize. But that's okay. <laughs> Here's another paper there. Here's another Paris with a stamp, and it says France, and oh gosh, I'm so sorry. I, I really did lean on the paper that time. And it uh, has this stamp. You can see that. Um, it's stamped, I can't make out the date, but 19-something, and I can't read French again. <laughs> Funny. Okay, anyway. Here she put a belly band here. More of those pretty lines. She's got some tags that were in this um, pocket here. I think a few fell out. They were several more in there. Or they're sticking together because I know I saw them before. Uh, <laughs> knows where they went, but they're here. Somewhere maybe the next place. I'm not sure. There was two of each. There was two of these. Maybe it's the other side. I know there were two more tags somewhere. Where'd they go? Oh, here they are. Because uh, I, I looked at one before. Here they are. Some hand. This says hand machine. And this was a different one. She's inked them. So aren't those really pretty? And then uh, those were in there. And I'll have to glue. I'll have to stitch this paper. But I'll have to glue that. It's coming this right there. But that's okay. Not a problem for me. And she sets this paper in. And she put a pretty little picture of a teapot there. She put another flower with a pearl and a tie. And here's the back. So uh, you tie that back together. And that was my uh, sister uh, 
June. It was due in June. She's through Swap. And thank you, uh, Belinda, so much for filling in and giving that to me. It, it was, uh, it's so beautiful, and I really do appreciate it. Uh, everything that you sent is just awesome. Like I said, it's so pretty, I didn't even want to open it, but I did, I did. Now, let's go over the snippet square. So, I'm going to put this right there. and Oh, and this. That came with it, too. And then, let's look at the snippet square. Uh, I don't know if there's really a direction on this. But I chose one. Uh, I chose this one with the uh, bow up here. And then there's a bow. It could be either way. Except for this way. The butterfly would be upside down. So we're going to make it this way. Uh, she made. Uh, it's kind of. Uh, uh, quilted. And then she's got different. Um, appliques and doilies. That she's cut and pieced together. And she's got some uh, beautiful pattern. Uh, flowers and textures on here, appliques and laces, and she's got this beautiful silver butterfly. She's got a trio of roses here. Here's some pretty blue roses here and here. Oh, and she's got some of those blue roses right here in the corner as well. And down here, she's got a zigzag stitch on this, and she's left room so that we can. Sew it together like we're supposed to. And then uh, here's another pin. What is that? Uh, just a pretty uh, two pearl with a, some, a rhinestone there. Here's a pretty rose. And another one of those blue flowers. A little applique sticking out. Here's some more applique trim. Some more netting. Crochet. Some zigzagging. And um, here's a piece of... Um, applique here she's got another blue flower on it and this thing is just packed full and beautiful and here's the other bow on this corner and it is a beautiful 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 uh snippet 12 by well 12 and a half by 12 and a half i think it was the size we were supposed to make square and it's a beautiful beginning to making a quilt so, uh, Belinda, thank you so much. I love it. I love it so much. And um, I hope you like the one I sent you as well. I'll try to take pictures, but I am going to publish this video tonight so everyone can see. Thank you, everyone, for watching. Oh, wait. Did I miss one? Oh, I think I showed y'all this one. This uh, set of tags is sitting over there. Yeah, and my, yeah. So anyway, uh, thank you, Belinda, all the way from Australia. Thank you very much. And y'all ladies, have a good night.